Hello, Year 7s. So this is the coral reef lesson, okay? So we understand where we're going. We did our colour wheel. Hello, colour wheel. So pretty. Um, anyway, don't be distracted by colour wheel. Move on. From that, we did our complementary colour fish. So the colour theory behind that one was that our complementaries are opposite each other on the colour wheel. So we have our red and green guy. Blah, 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 blah. Hello. We have our seahorse with yellow and purples. And this jaunty little guy in orange and blue. So now I want to discuss the family of the hot and cold colours. So we can divide our um, colour wheel into half. Half being the hot colours and half being the cold colours. So we're going to make ourselves a coral reef. That little guy's fallen off there. So on one side I have my hot colours. So think fire, burning, yellows, orange and reds. And then on this side we have our cold colours of purples, blues and greens. Now in school I had access to paint and I had access to different colour pa uh, papers and pens. So I understand that while we're off at home, we might not have all those kind of things, but just where you can, you could cut up carrier bags. You can use different colour pens and papers to make a surface and then cut out. Here you can see I've worked in and made holes with a hole puncher. So just to make nice and bright and bold, if you can't fill your whole page, you could do a smaller version coming out from the middle, okay? And then I've got a little tag here for the cold side and for the hot side. So hopefully that will give you something as a starting point. Well, good luck, guys.